What is up guys, it's Copes here and today I'm back with another Fortnite video. I know I'm a little bit late to the party, but I'm gonna make this video anyways. There's a bunch of new leaked skins, pickaxes, and gliders, and a couple other things that we'll talk about later in this video. And I have no reason not to believe these leaks are true. We already have one of the skins and one of the pickaxes already in this game. They were added, I think, two days ago. So there's really no reason for me not to believe that these skins are real and they're coming to the game. I know there were some leaks before that actually came into the game later. I made a video on that. Maybe I'll link it in the description if you guys want to check that out. Just to kind of confirm that these skins will really come to the game. So I'm excited to see these skins. Hopefully sooner rather than later. I'm assuming they'll come out during the weekend of Easter. Or maybe the week after. Maybe the Monday after. We'll have to wait and see. I don't know exactly when they'll come out. But when do you guys think they'll come out? But let's get into the skins. So our first skin we have the Rare Midnight Ops. This skin is very similar to Shadow Ops. I think it's basically the guy version of Shadow Ops. I absolutely love Shadow Ops. So I can't really hate on midnight ops too much i still think i love shadow ops a little bit too much to put midnight ops any higher than her but if if i were to buy a skin right now it'd probably be midnight ops just because he's newer and we also have another new pickaxe that was just recently added it's a rare one it's called specter it looks very similar to trusty number two at least it's very small it's black it doesn't have the pencil going through it but you know it looks very similar i would say these are both these were both added very recently so i can't really deny that these skins and pickaxes and gliders are all coming very soon maybe within a month maybe within two months we'll have to wait and see but i think all these are coming very soon our next skin is a legendary skin there's actually two legendary skins that will be added in the near future probably within the next couple weeks i would have to say maybe one the first week i would assume it would be the raven skin it's a legendary skin the first leg legendary skin we're going to be talking about take a look at this man he has no face he has those glowing eyes and the shadowy background because of his hoodie i guess i don't really know what's giving him that shadow i don't know what his face looks like but this man looks badass and this is a skin i am going to buy if i don't buy any of these other skins i will buy the raven so expect some gameplay with this guy when he inevitably comes out i think this is the coolest skin by far out of this list tell me what your favorite is do you guys think i mean can you really disagree that the raven is the coolest out of these i think he's definitely the most creative and most badass by far next we have the rabbit raider and i think at least the face mask for his design was taken from jason can you guys agree with that since it's like the halloween week event or weekend event whatever it may be but we have the Rabbit Raider, he's an epic skin. So I think this is gonna be 1200 to 1500 V-Bucks. It'll probably be 1500 V-Bucks just because it's it's a Halloween event and these like events, they wanna make as much money as possible. So they're definitely gonna have this one at 1500 V-Bucks. I'd be surprised if, it, I, if I was wrong. But this one, I think I like it better than the girl skin we're about to talk about just because of that face mask. Even though the pink color I don't really like more than the white, I think the face mask really makes them a lot more scary and a lot edgier than this um, bunny brawler that I guess I'll talk about right now. This is the second um, epic skin we're going to be talking about and actually the second skin in this leaked information. So the bunny brawler is a black girl with a white a white bunny suit on i mean she looks all right i don't i don't really like the smiling faces too much i'd rather have some depressing or angry character rather than just a super happy for our next legendary skin we have the dark vanguard this is basically like the dark voyager but the girl skin i thought the red knight looked so much better than the black knight maybe because it was newer maybe because not many people had it but I think the Dark Vanguard is definitely going to look a lot better than the Dark Voyager. So I think this is another skin I really want to get. I think the Dark Vanguard and the Raven are two I'm going to get. As long as I have the money, maybe I'll spend 50 bucks and get them both. And the skins they or the back bling they have is really fucking epic. So I can't really deny myself from... I can't really stop myself from getting these skins. For our next skin, we have the only uncommon skin. So 
This one is one you can probably buy without, you know, spending too much money. Maybe it'll be 800 V-Bucks, maybe it'll be 500, most likely it'll be 800, I would say. We have a Whiplash. This is basically like a racer skin. I don't really know how this fits in the design of the Halloween weekend, but it kind of goes with the Dark Voyager, so maybe these will be released on the same day, maybe the same week. We'll have to wait and see, but Whiplash looks pretty cool, I would say. If you're if you're going to just spend a couple bucks on this game and you want a new skin, I would say Whiplash is definitely a skin you should get because it'll be cheap and you won't have to spend too many V-Bucks on it. It looks decent. For our first back bling, they're both legendary. We have the Dark Void, which is going to go with the Dark Vanguard. This thing looks amazing. I would say these back blings are the two best to ever be in Fortnite. That's before they've been added, so I can't really say for sure how cool they're gonna look actually in game, but this thing looks amazing, and I cannot wait to see it in game. Look at that, look at that like, um, pinkish purple on the back. I mean, it kind of looks like um, a magic ball that uh, a medium would read to you, but I don't know exactly. I don't even know if that's the right term, medium. Is that the right term? Mine, re ah, fuck it, whatever. Next is the Iron Cage. This, I, I can't decide if I like this more, but this is a legendary back bling that will go with the Raven. So I think, honestly, I would just buy these skins, if not for the skin, for the back bling, because I would wear this so often, I would wear both of these so often, but I think I like the Iron Cage just a little bit more. It looks so beautiful, guys, I love it. What do you guys like the most out of the skins and back bling so far? So we have the hard boiled egg, which is an epic, and the eggshell, which is also an epic. They're two Easter eggs. I don't know exactly what they're gonna be. Are these gonna be back bling? Or are they gonna be something different? Are, are they gonna be grenades? Are they gonna be shot out from a grenade launcher? Maybe one's a grenade, one's gonna be shot out from a grenade launcher. I don't really know. I can't think of what these are. Maybe they're backpacks for the Rabbit Raider and the Bunny Brawler, but it doesn't really look like these guys have backpacks, so I can't really say for sure what these are or what they're gonna be used for. Everyone leave your comments down below telling me what these are used for, because I honestly have no idea at this point. So someone correct me if I'm wrong, but the Royal Flag, that's another back bling, so I don't know if those eggs are gonna be back bling, but we're gonna skip that. You guys tell me what you think, but the Royal Flags have already been added. I've seen some gameplay on them. So I think they go with the Wukong skin. Correct me if I'm wrong, but these things look so amazing in game. I really wanna buy the Wukong skin to get them, and I'm pretty sure they go with them. So this one, I mean, it doesn't look as good as the other two back blings we talked about, but it definitely is up there for probably top five, my top five favorites, I would say. Now we're gonna get into the gliders. We have the orbital shuttle, which is an epic, and we have the deep space lander, which is also an epic. I thought I would just go over these because they look very similar. The, de the deep space lander would probably go with the dark vanguard, I would say. Let me check what the orbital shuttle would go with. I don't know exactly what that would go with. Maybe it's just not really, um, it's not really themed with anything. It kind of would go with that, um, Moonwalker skin from the Season 3 Battle Pass, I would say. But I would definitely buy one of these. This is like the first glider that I I'm really excited to see. I don't really think I'm gonna buy any other glider. If I can buy a fucking plane to glide around with, you know, maybe I'll actually buy it. But let's get into our next one, our next glider. We have the Feathered Flyer, which is gonna go with the Raven. So the Raven is getting all types of things that are going with it. Fucking back bling glider. I don't think it has a pickaxe yet. Maybe it'll have some sort of pickaxe that goes with it. But it basically has some wings um, going through the middle of it and it looks pretty cool. This, I mean gliders, I'm not a very huge fan of gliders, but when the really crazy one, ones come out, you know, I'll actually give it a chance. I'll, I'll look at it at least and I'll be impressed by it, but usually I won't buy them regardless of what they look like. But I think I'll actually buy the like, spaceship ones. We'll see though. So let's get into our last thing for today. We have the Spectre um, pickaxe, which we already talked about. And then we have the carrot stick as well. I think the carrot stick looks really funny. I still don't think it looks good enough to buy, but it's one of those that maybe I'll have to see it in gameplay and then I'll decide whether I'm going to buy it or not. But for, for now, I'm probably not going to buy this pickaxe. I can see myself buying it in the future. We'll have to wait and see. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Tell me what your favorite pickaxes, gliders, 
and skins were from this video. Do you guys, like, do you have any ideas of what else they may add? I would really like to see some other Halloween designs, some, like, designs based off of characters from movies. Maybe um, Mike Myers design, I think that would look really cool, and it could maybe look very similar to the Reaper, which I think is a very cool skin design. So, everyone leave your comments down below telling me what you want to see from this game, what you want to see from the skins, from the gliders, from the pickaxes, and tell me what those easter eggs are, because I don't really know at this point. But thanks guys for watching, I'll see you later, bye bye.